What's up guys and welcome to a brand new Five Nights at Freddy's AR update video. Now in today's video, we have a brand new teaser trailer from Illumix themselves. It's actually titled FNAF AR Teaser 2, along with some other stuff that we're going to be discussing in today's video. So overall, it's going to be a super exciting video. And if you guys are hyped and you guys want to see FNAF AR on the channel and you're hyped to see it, be sure to smash like on the video. Let's absolutely crush 5k likes, so be sure to absolutely leave a like on this video if you guys like what you see in today's video. But let's go ahead and get into what was revealed. Oh, and also real quick before I do though, be sure to check out my second channel and hit subscribe on it. I'll linked in the description i'm trying to hit 100k on it so i'd really appreciate it. if you guys like what you see on this channel to head over there and hit that subscribe button on that one like i said links in the description and in the comment down below but let's go ahead and get into what was revealed so like i said a new fnaf ar teaser trailer was launched and it's got some pretty exciting things in it that i think you guys are going to really enjoy along with a special admit one early access ticket which is going to be super cool but yeah like i said we're going to cover it all in order so let's go ahead and start the fnaf ar teaser 2 trailer so it's the same as before. See, it's got that same kind of glitch. I will find you. Seven new meds, ten new meds, twelve new messages. Holy, they're spamming the phone. Something special just for you. Look at that. So I don't know if you guys heard that right there, though, but. That sounded like Freddy Fazbear talking. I don't know. Maybe that was just me or I'm, people are thinking like Fredbear or Freddy Fazbear. So I really have no idea. But what I'm going to go ahead and do is I'm going to go ahead and start the recording on the main screen. And we're going to go ahead and break this all down. So from basically from the beginning right here, it's nothing that we haven't seen before, really. You know, it's all just the same stuff. The table, the cupcake, the endoskeleton in the back and stuff like that. I think the main difference from this one is obviously the talking in it, which is, like I said, either Freddy or Fredbear. I'm assuming it's probably Freddy, though, judging by the bow tie and stuff like that. I don't know. It's where it's placed. It seems like that's probably who's talking, but we currently have no idea. And then, of course, these dates at the very end right here, which if we try to pause it, it shows a few different dates. Let me see if I can get like a good... It's like right there, it shows... Okay, so one of the first dates, I don't know if you saw that. It says 1020. So, oh, okay, so there's 11, 19, 87. But then right before that, I can't get it. But trust me, like, see right there. So it says 1020. Um, and I'm assuming that's obviously this month. So, you know, that would be in five days. So Sunday. So we might be getting the game on that day or possibly some kind of a trailer, like a gameplay trailer. Because it's really interesting. Like, we were all kind of thinking that we'd be getting a gameplay trailer next. But instead, we got this, which, is, I mean, it's cool, but it's not exactly what we were expecting. And also, it doesn't really give us, like, a set release date. You know, it kind of throws a bunch of dates at us, which we'll see in just a second. So if I pause it, you get, once again, you get that 11, 1987. Then you get 8, 2006. You get what appears to be 8, 2009, which, or 2019, which I I don't know. Is it saying next month on the 8th is the release date? Or, I mean, we don't know. Then we get 2104. I, I mean, guys, comment down below whatever numbers you see, basically, because I want to see, you know, what they all are. But it seems like it's just like a bunch of random numbers currently. So 62999. And then it says admit one. And then it kind of goes to complete darkness. Now, if we go and listen to this voice here. Come on. Let's see. And something special just for you. Oh. So he said, I planned something special just for you. Ooh, okay, that's cool. So that's the main, you know, teaser trailer that we have right there. Now, if we head over to their website, you actually get this right here. Now, before it before this shows up for you guys, if you're wondering, you're like, if you go to the website and you don't see this, you have to give them your email and sign up. You have to pre-register for the game. And then you get an early access ticket to FNAF AR, and it's obviously special delivery. It's got this little gold ticket right here. It says, Fazbear Entertainment will deliver a confirmation direct to your inbox. Keep your eyes peeled to see if you win an early access ticket to the game. And then, if you actually bring up your ticket right here, which, let me see if I can. Okay, so... Here's my ticket on screen right now, as you guys can see, and it just kind of says, you know, your first special delivery from Fazbear Entertainment has arrived. Uh, since you have pre-registered, you are now eligible for an early access ticket, and then it shows this, like, little envelope right here, and it says, be on the lookout for more special deliveries from Fazbear Entertainment and your chance to experience the fun, fun, fun early. So it looks like they're actually going to be giving out the game early if you pre-register, I guess, to only certain people, which... I don't know how to feel about that. I'd rather them just kind of release it, but I don't know. It looks like, you know, you're just going to be kind of 
you have to get lucky. And if you do, you actually get a uh, possible early access to the game, which would obviously be very exciting. Um, but then on that little envelope right there, it actually shows a few characters that, you know, we kind of know, known were coming and then some other ones. So we have Baby on there, which we knew. Um, Foxy, Freddy, Bonnie, Chica, and the Cupcakes. And really no one knew, but, you know, it's interesting to see the baby icon right there on there. So that at least shows that, you know, she's definitely 100% going to be in the game in some way, shape, or form. But I'm just curious as to what's next. Because, I mean, obviously... In this, okay, so what we got from this trailer was we know that, you know, Freddy is going to have a voice actor, possibly Fredbear. We currently, you know, don't really know for sure the fact who it is. We just know that it's some kind of animatronic voice, most likely Freddy, though. Um, and we also see that we can now pre register for early access. Now, if you do get this, that's going to be pretty huge because I'm just, I'm wondering why they're doing early access, though. Like, why not just release the game? Why give certain people early access and not everybody? Like, is it going to be an early build of the game where it could have bugs or, you know, what's up with the early access? I'm just curious what's up with like i'm curious maybe it's like for marketing so like they get your email and then you know for future games they can kind of email you saying hey we have this game coming out you know maybe it's one of those things just to kind of like get more you know people to check out their other games or something like that i currently have no idea though but it is cool i mean it's cool to just be able to sign up give them your email and then you get like an early access ticket it's like you're going to like willy wonka's chocolate factory or something like that where like you know you, you get the golden ticket and you get you get something really nice which obviously would be the game very early now if that date in the trailer is correct, though, that 10 20 2019, I'm pretty sure. Let me check real quick. Yeah, that is Sunday. So that's literally in five days from today. So four days after, you know, today, obviously. So, I mean, if they are, I don't know if that's the early access release date. Because here's the thing like, if that's the actual release date, release date for the game, that means early access could be getting released today, you know, tomorrow. It could be getting released any of these days, which would obviously be very exciting. But it would also cause a lot of panic because certain people would be getting it, certain people wouldn't be. Everyone would be trying to get it. You know, I feel like it'd cause a lot of panic. But I mean, I'm assuming this is my thought process. Okay, so you get the you get the golden ticket, the admit one early access ticket, and then on the 20th, that's when they start handing out early access to certain people. You know, they they randomly select people. Hopefully, they just kind of give it to everyone. That's what I think would be more you know right. Just everyone that gave you your their email, just kind of send them you know the early access because why not? You know, it, I don't I don't know. I feel like this whole like restriction thing where like you have to get lucky enough to get it is kind of weird. Um, and also I forgot to mention this, but on their Twitter account, they actually did make a tweet, and it, it's kind of weird. So. Um, one of the tweets that they post, which I'm not going to show this one, just says, pre-registered to be eligible for FNAF AR early access ticket at FNAFAR.com. And then, you know, it just kind of says augmented reality and stuff like that. So nothing really too important. Um, but then on the FNAF AR actual page, that was on the Illumix page. On the FNAF AR official page, it says this. But I'll go ahead and show this on screen. So it says start update or start system update, FNAF AR system. And then it kind of shows a bunch of stuff. System update complete run diff and then fnaf ar teaser dot vid fnaf ar teaser dot vid early access ticket ticket dot reg so register i'm guessing and then a link to the trailer and it says pre-register now for a chance at early access so obviously they're really trying to hype this up they're trying to get you know all these people to sign up for it and i mean i'm on board but it does kind of like i said it just kind of concerns me that we haven't seen any actual gameplay for the game you know i feel like if they if they if they're able to release this kind of short teaser trailer then you know why not throw in just a little bit of gameplay just so we have somewhat of a feeling as to what's happening i mean i know we have you know different press screenshots and stuff like that like we've had some gameplay shown off but for the most part you know we haven't really seen anything like how it's actually going to play out we've just seen certain little gameplay snippets which i'm actually on their website right now and i just realized they have a new um freddy model right here so he's actually holding the giant golden ticket that is so cool if i remember i'll put it in on screen right now but if not just head over to the fnaf vr website and check it out let me see if i can actually download oh you can <laughs> you can just have freddy holding a giant golden ticket now <laughs> Well, that's fun. Well, oh wait, I just got an email. Hold on. Now, now here's the thing. Like every time I get an email, now I'm gonna be checking. Like I got an email from them, but it's old. I think. I hope. Let me see. It says FNAF AR. Yeah, you're eligible for early access. So, I don't know. I'm curious to seeing what's gonna happen here. I, I'm assuming. I mean, I'd still really like some kind of a gameplay trailer. You know, in the coming days, just some kind of. You know, even if it's like a short little thing, just anything to kind of have people have a feel for what's gonna be coming out instead of just kind of releasing and just be like, oh, here's the game. <laughs> Go download it. And I'm also curious, is it going to cost money? I'm assuming it will, but if it doesn't and it's free, free to play, that would mean that they're going to have some kind of microtransactions in the game. And if they do, I'm curious as to what those would be because I hope it's not going to be like you have to buy certain animatronics. I doubt they would do that. I'm assuming the game is just going to come out. It's going to be one set price. But then again, if they're doing early access, 
then it can't be. It would have to be free to play, right? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know how early access would work for this. I don't know. I mean, either way, it's exciting. It looks like, I mean, just the fact that we got a Freddy Fazbear voice in this game or in this trailer, that means that we're going to be getting that for, you know, the rest of the, the characters too. So Baby, obviously we know she has a voice actor. Now Freddy, Fredbear possibly, um, Foxy, all of them are all going to have their own unique voice actors. And for an augmented reality game for your phone, I mean, we all just thought this was going to be like some simple little, you know, not, not to be offensive or anything like that, but like throwaway game before obviously we saw what they're doing now that we've seen what they're doing this is definitely not going to be some simple throwaway game that you don't have to worry about after a week you know this seems like it's going to be a very long game like it's going to have a lot of lore to it it's going to have voice actors for everybody it's going to have different animatronics throughout the entire game and you know i'm assuming it's probably also going to be getting updates too along with you know fnaf ar and stuff like that so it seems like scott's definitely making it to where it doesn't just these games don't just come out and then they're over like fnaf ar or fnaf vr we're getting new stuff all the time this game i'm assuming we're going to be getting new updates all the time so i don't know it's exciting it overall it's super exciting i'm just I wish they gave a more straightforward answer, though, to, like, a release date. You know, like, this 1020, I wish they said coming out or coming 1020 or early access begins 1020, you know, something like that. But anyways, guys, if you enjoyed the video, leave a like. If you're new, hit that subscribe button and the little bell icon to be first videos. And I'll see you all in the next one. Peace out.